Hey everybody, it's Heather from Storing Up My Treasures at Blogspot, and I know it's been a long time no see. Um, I've not been on my blog a whole lot lately, or as you can tell, recording videos. It's been a pretty busy couple of months since we moved. But anyway, I wanted to go ahead and share a haul with you guys. I just placed an order not that long ago um, at Jenny Boland's website, which is JBS Mercantile, and I'll pull the, put the information in my comments below. She has a really great sale going on right now, and I just checked earlier today, and everything I'm showing you right now is still on sale on her website. So phenomenal deals on some stuff, so you should definitely go and check it out. So, and as you guys are going to see, I've got a different background going on. I'm recording this in my sister's bedroom, so we'll see how this goes. It's been a while since I've done this, and I'm taking a quick break from my Stash Buster scrapbooking series. Um, I have a couple of layouts. I want to get some more done. I've honestly not scrapbooked since I've moved, which is with end of July, so I need to get back into the swing of things. So I placed an order to kind of get me going again, and hopefully I'll have some stuff to share with you guys soon. So let's go ahead and get started. So here we go. Oops, a daisy. So first of all, I'm going to share with you guys all the stickers I got. So most of these sticker sheets were anywhere between like a dollar and I want to say a dollar fifty or a dollar seventy-five was the most I paid for any one thing. So I this is a um this is the vintage red stickers, which is on a cream background, just like little mono st mini stickers. This is the red and black dotted labels, and honestly, the dots are more of gray than black, and it's on a cream background with a red border. This is also on a cream background. This is the multi-dotted labels, and it's a multicolor pastel dots with a yellow border. I got these in red and green. These are the star banner stickers, and these are really nice. It might be hard to pick up in the camera here, but the stars themselves have really tiny little white polka dots on them. And then you can take these letters off and position them in the middle of the stars if you'd like to make actual um, banners with um, sayings or letters on them or whatnot. This one is a, it's called the Reader Banner Stickers, and it's basically super cute Dick and Jane um, graphics, and then polka dots, and then down here on the bottom are some letters. Oops, I lost a sticker on this one. This is a mini chalkboard alpha in red, and it's on a cream uh, background with red lettering. This one is called a reverse red, which is just red with cream lettering. These are circular. Um, this is another one of the dotted labels. This is a cream background with pink polka dot and green border. This one doesn't, it's just a solid cream background with the red border, and this is just called Red Label Stickers. All of those are 5x7 in size. And then I got this package of bingo cards. These are 5x7 cardstock, and these are just letters. And so I was going to just cut those up and use those for different things. So that's all the stickers I got. Um, moving on to the paper. So I got two things um, that were not Christmas related in the um, cardstock. Got a couple of sheets from her Haven collection. This one is just the Haven accessory sheet and it's got borders and journaling tags and journaling spots and on the flip side is polka dot. And then this one, this is the flip side, and this is the front side, and this is her Haven mini pattern sheet. So this is basically just the 4x4 four four squares of the Haven collection itself. And I want to say those were like 80 cents a piece. Okay, and then I got a bunch of um, Christmas pages in her cardstock as well. So this is the 2011 holiday. This is called the Carol Index Paper. I'm going to be cutting these up into band or border strips and using them for different things. These are really, really cool. I love the font on that. And then it's got a cool little scalloped um, background. This one is called the Wrapping Paper. It's a really cool old um, wrapping paper pattern on one side and then a cute little snowy um, cabin square repeat on the back. This one is called the, this is the accessory sheet. So a bunch of really cool borders, some different tags. You could certainly use these for gift tags and then some neat journaling and spots there. And that's a cream on with a red polka dot. And then they also, I got a, um, this is the mini pattern sheet. So it's basically just the mini patterns of her holiday collection from this year. And very similar to what I got, showed you before, but it also has this cool holly here. And this down here, I, it just kind of almost reminds me of like an old game board. So that's that. 
She also had an absolutely fantastic deal where you could get 50 sheets of her scrapbooking paper for five bucks, 10 cents each. You are not going to get it cheaper than that. And the cool thing is, is a lot of this stuff was exclusive to her JBS Mercantile site. So if you pay for her monthly collections that she puts out, um, you got this paper. So it's stuff that you can't even get in the store. It's only available through her website and if you order these uh, monthly kits from her. So this is a, uh, so I'll just, I'll tell you what's exclusive and then if there's a name on there, then I can give you a name. So this was an exclusive. Um, this is another exclusive. These cute tags. Another exclusive polka dots. This is an exclusive. I really like that. Very, very cute. And let's see here. I'm, so, I'm going to turn these around so I don't have to keep turning them weird. This is another exclusive. Stars. And this is another exclusive. It's really pretty floral. Butterflies on a red polka dot background. That's an exclusive. It's cool old um, soda water labels. That's an exclusive. Really pretty um, vine pattern. That's an exclusive. Cute little starburst with polka dot pattern. That's an exclusive. A pretty uh, cream and a green ledger. That's an exclusive. Pretty like a... Um, Almost reminds me of like a flower sack, um, like a dish towel or whatnot, old vintage um, fabric. That's an exclusive. Really pretty big floral graphic. That's an exclusive. This is basically just a print page from like a book of some kind on a yellow background. That's an exclusive. Harlequin design. That's exclusive. Pretty floral. That one's exclusive. This one I know isn't an exclusive. This is quilted floral. Pretty cute. This would be really cute to put in some kind of a signage. That's called Chicken Feed. Look at those super cute songbirds. How cute is that? That's called Tweet Tweet. Cherries and cherry blossoms. Cherry on top. Real pretty geometric and a tulip design. That's called Geo Flower. Another cute geometric design that's called Green Cross Hatch. Um, tulips and cute flowers, tiny tulips. A pink background plaid that's called Pretty Plaid. A real pretty floral um, polka dot that's called Oil Cloth. So that's the first set. And then this is the second half of that 50 for $5 paper pack. And just for fun, I ordered two sets of the $5 special just to see if the paper varied and it didn't. It's exactly the same. So it's, um, if you order more than one set, you're going to get the same stuff like I did. So this one is called Trendy Floral. This is a navy tiny dot. Pretty self-explanatory. This one is called Navy Harlequin. This real pretty brocade pattern is called Red Wallpaper. And this cute little cherries on a cream background that's called Cherry Pie. Real pretty orange blossoms with a blue vine background that's called Apron Strings. Uh, cherries with blue foliage, it's called Clothesline. Really cute old um, flower label here. That one's called Flower Sack. Big blown up ledger paper on cream background. That one is Country Store. Another real pretty cream um, yellow floral buttercup. Cute little repeating red flowers. It's called Snack Time. Cute little scalloped border kickball stripe. Real pretty. I like this one a lot. It reminds me of an old lace tablecloth picnic lunch. Super excited about that one. Um, this one is Target Practice. This one's really cute as well. This is called Sunny Day. This almost reminds this one I really like. It's cool. I don't, I don't even know how to explain it. It's hard to see. It's really, really small little uh, circles and little blue um, flecks. That one's called Nap Time. Oversized big red polka dot, pink large dot, real pretty large oversized floral that's called um, Kitty's Floral. A pink and a 
floral design, bubblegum feed sack, uh, cream and a brown large polka dot, brown large dot, <laughs> another book print page, that one's called brown book print, another large graphic um, floral brown jumbo flower, this is from her Haven collection, I'm excited about that, that one's called great photo, a uh, brown floral pattern, this is called afternoon, and then a very similar to one of her other ones I got. This is Sheriff's Office. The um, other one, I believe, had like a navy background on the star, and this one's black. So anyway, so that's everything I got from my Jenny Bolin order. So anywho, um, I'm excited to hopefully get back into the swing of things and start recording more videos soon. Um, and hopefully I'll get back into my scrapbooking here anytime now. And we can start back up our Stash Buster scrapbooking series. Hope you guys are doing great. I look forward to hearing from some of you. Um, thanks so much for watching, guys. Happy crafting.